September 19. Quick note about today's episode. Content warning for suicide mention and graphic medical description. September 19th, 1818, Lord Byron writes that he's finished writing the first canto of Don Juan. And yes, it's Don Juan. It looks like Don Juan, but it's Don Juan. September 19, 1911, Lord of the Flies author William Golding is born. September 19, 1996, the Spice Girls released their album, Spice. Saturday, September 19, 1998, Andre Perrin's opera, A Streetcar Named Desire, premieres. On the same day, I read, as part of my homework, some of Gustav Eckstein's The Body Has a Head. Dr. Parisi loves this book. A sample. Quote, The suicide who prefers the mouth route rests his revolver against his palate, arms straight back, and even if he trembles, is apt to achieve his wish, blows out everything in the neighborhood of the fourth ventricle, a savage wish. He muddies and bloodies medulla and pons. To dissect with a revolver is not real meat. End quote. I also finished reading Toni Morrison's Beloved. Then Teresa and I went to Media Play to buy Jamie CDs for her birthday. I bought her Jock Jams Volume 4. Therese wanted to buy her an NSYNC CD, but I told her Jamie probably already has that one. We stopped at Martin's supermarket, bought brownie mix, went back to St. Mary's, and made brownies. We ate them while watching Air Force One. September 19, 1999, South Bend. When I woke up, I found a note from Mom saying that she and Dad were getting married. They're already married, but they were renewing their vows in a ceremony for couples celebrating their 25th and 50th anniversaries. It was held at St. Matthew's Cathedral and presided over by the local bishop. Afterward, they had dinner at the East Bank Emporium. I went to the Hallmark store and bought my parents a wedding card. I also bought myself a 60-cent Halloween postcard. I stopped at Meyer to pick up photos. When I got home, I sat in the living room watching Adam Sadler host a show about funny videos on MTV. They included the Foo Fighters' Big Me and the Beastie Boys' Sabotage. Mom and Dad came home with leftover steak provolone and cookies shaped like little wedding cakes. Sunday, September 19, 2010, Mishawaka. Jamie is in town from Ohio visiting her parents, but she made time to have lunch at Applebee's with me. Tit didn't want to come, but I brought him some baby back ribs. Friday, September 19, 2014. Tit and I saw the actors from the London stage performance of Much Ado About Nothing at Notre Dame's Washington Hall. He got bored in the middle, went outside, and took a nap on a bench through part of the performance. On the same day in 2014, Tony Bennett and Lady Gaga released Cheek to Cheek, the first of their two collaborative jazz album. 